Breaking news at four. We just learned the name of the officer shot and the two victims killed in the gas station shooting in Bossier City yesterday. According to Bossier Police, Officer Kenny Guyon was shot in the line of duty while running into gunfire. Guyon has been working for the Bossier Police for seven years and he's married with two children. We're also learning more about the two people killed and the details of that shooting. Our KSLA News 12 Jasmine Franklin attended the news conference just moments ago. What's the new information that you learned about yesterday's deadly shooting, Jasmine? Yes, that's right. The press conference was held just a few minutes ago where police and the city of Bossier are releasing more information regarding that deadly shooting yesterday where two people were killed. We now know the names of those two victims as well as more information regarding the shooting yesterday and the, the person that is in custody. Now, the person that is in custody, uh, well, actually, those, those two victims have been identified as Joshua Cock and Jariah Hamilton. Now, Cock was a customer and Hamilton was a cashier. Police say the robbery was the initial intent and the shots fired call came in yesterday around 10 30 a.m. to Bossier police. When police arrived, there was an exchange of gunfire between the subject and police. One officer was struck and is in stable condition. Police have arrested that suspect I mentioned earlier, Cornell Burks, and he now faces first degree homicide charges and police say more charges are coming. Bossier police talk about how that how they were able to capture Burks. So as unfortunate as this is, we see that the suspect, after the shooting, he then fled to a nearby hotel, which was the, uh, help me, the Labossier. And we want to um, commend the manager that was on duty. After hearing the shots, she locked the door. And by locking the door, he was unable to make entry. And by not being able to make entry, he did no further harm. And he was then confronted by Bossier City Police Department, at which time they identified him as the uh, person who was responsible and at that time arrested him. Now, I spoke with the Valero gas station manager earlier today, and she describes Hamilton, her employee who was the cashier at the time of the shooting, as a very nice person. She said he was a very hard worker and also very new on the job. Live in Bossier, Jasmine Franklin, KSLA News 12.